Then we got another little old bridge and a river house of some kind with the foundation just built right in, old rock work. And a little dock for your canoe. Is that cool or what? There's some old remnant infrastructure stuff. Looks like they used narrow gauge rail rails to secure it. I wonder where they got those. And we'll be heading that way momentarily. All right, and now we cross Boston Ave. Heading over into West Medford that way. Heading to Somerville that way. And there's old broad ironwork in reasonably good condition. Can't say the same over there. Yeah, the river's looking pretty happy around here. Confluence with the alewife. Ah, and here's the corresponding track of trail. More old infrastructure rotting stuff. edge. <coughs> Not much of a trail presence over along here. Ooh, what is this? Oh, those are private residence steps for canoes and stuff. Huh. Stonework is a lot cooler on this side. Wow, look at that. So there is a more formal walkway over there. Which is probably all it's needed. Is just some sort of little vernacular wormhole? Nope. At least not for people. where we'll run into our next street. Yeah, nice flow around here. <laughs> Annoyed the heron again. <laughs> we seem to be coinciding a lot. I've been reading about how Herons are losing their fear of proximity to humans since we haven't bothered shooting them in around a hundred years. So they're coexisting, becoming almost like storks in Europe. Large, ungainly, yet graceful looking birds living in close proximity to their former nemesis. There's 
more. Bank side access. That magnificent old row of trees that probably date back to the Roosevelt era MDC work. That's why they called them parkways. Up oh, and there's another little water access. And an old bench. Looks ancient. Give it a little appreciation. Oh yeah, we're coming to the confluence with Alewife. There's a giant siphon. <laughs> Nonetheless appealing. Oh, and there goes a boat. <laughs> that must be fun. State police patrolling the Mystic. Yeah, that's gonna be some sweet duty. Niceness all around. <laughs> and now we'll wander over the Meadford Meadows. See if we can't find that Alewife Brook thing I keep yapping about. Oh yeah, it does look like This is a fun place for creatures that like meadows. <laughs> this is so cool. It's kind of like save on the budget for mowing lawns and create a somewhat absent habitat. The restoration of vaguely meadowish stuff here in the beating heart of the city. And look at this quaint old ruin. It's part of the MDC waterworks, I believe. Who knows? It's now called the MWRA. And the river's bending up off towards Winchester. This gets a fair amount of use. People consider it an amenity. It's kind of re-rustified condition actually makes it fairly appealing. So yeah, this is a pump house and a major water line crosses under the river right around here. Now we ought to be finding our way over to the place where the alewife meets it.
Uh oh, looks like they're doing some kind of work. Shutter. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> squirrel. A boreal frenzy. Yeah, they're fixing yet another neglected and half total bridge. Nice. Yeah, looks like I found the Alewife Confluence and extensive repairs of some kind are underway. It was in this general area a week or so ago that uh, a gas tank truck or something, an oil tank truck, tipped over and spilled a bunch of toxic crap into the drink. So it looks like there's a bunch of new work that's been done around here. That heads down off to Arlington. And this ends up in North Cambridge after a bit of flirtation with Somerville. And they just stroll off in the general vicinity of Davis Square or some such thing. We are indeed at Alewife Brook Parkway and the Alewife Reservation. This looks like a backside of Tufts Dorms or something. That's Capon Street, which goes down at Tufts. Maybe it's some kind of public housing or maybe even speculative condos. And this is the new Alewife Brook Pumping Station. Probably replacing that old one over there, which is probably in mothballs because it's loaded with asbestos and heaven knows what. So, when I next attempt to make sense of this stuff, I'll explore some of Ale Life. 